Investigators have their work cut out for them. I got an update from an officer here earlier, and she describes this as tragic. Now, they're going to spend the next few hours trying to figure out exactly who these people are and what led to this crash. Now, we want to show you around a little bit. Police have us pretty far back, but if you take a look just over here around the caution tape, you can see they're focused on uh, just down the road there. That is where that SUV went off the road, hitting that tree again, four people killed. But we want to give you a closer look. Let's go to video. So there in the dark, you can see investigators with flashlights looking over what's left of that SUV. Prince George's County Police say that SUV was heading east on Woodmore around 7.30 p.m. when it left the road and crashed into the tree. Again, police say that SUV was engulfed in flames, and by the time EMTs arrived, all four people inside pronounced dead. The police say they'll probably be out here well into the morning as they try to figure out who those people are and what caused this crash. Over the next couple hours, investigators will, um, you know, they look at roadway um, marks on the roadway and things like that to try to determine what happened to lead to this crash. For reasons that are under investigation, it left the roadway and struck a tree. All four occupants in the vehicle were pronounced deceased on scene. And back out here live. So you can see the flares now here in the road as Prince George's County Police are diverting traffic here on Woodmore. Now, when we got an update from police earlier, they say they will be updating their social media as they try to notify people in this area about those road closures. Also, there's the message for people who live in this area who may have seen what happened. They're asking them to call police. Reporting live in Prince George's County, Walter Morris, News 4. All right.